What's going on, people? This is Star Child from Original American Foundation. This is a little late. It's about a day or two late, but this is the final installment of our uh, Snap Pea Spotlight. So this Snap Pea right here is the first one that I planted. It's a little more advanced than the other ones uh, down at the garden as far as the progression of the growth. Um, when you're about to see the actual Snap Peas themselves forming, you'll get these flowers. Get a good shot of those, but these flowers here, you see, and those flowers here will is what will actually convert into the snap peas. And um, I would say give this one about another maybe two or three weeks, um, and these will be ready to pull. So this is our final final installment. Um, I'll give a little bit of nutrition facts and some history on snap peas. And um, then we'll bring August in with our next spotlight crop, which I haven't choose yet. We'll kind of make that a surprise and we'll find out together. All right, everybody, this is Star Child, Original American Foundation. Stay tuned for our August spotlight crop. Peace. All right, y'all, now for a little bit of history and nutritional facts on sugar snap peas and peas in general. They are high in vitamin C, uh, which is good for the immune system, vitamin K, which is good for clot factors in the blood, also fiber, which is good for digestion and, and elimination, and also high in protein, which is good for just protein in general or people that might be vegan or don't eat meat. It can supply the protein that you need in your diet. Uh, peas in general are native to Asia, specifically the Middle East area, Turkey, Iraq area. Um, sugar snap peas, however, were brought to fruition by Calvin Lamborn in 1979 when he crossed garden peas with snow peas. Different ways to prepare peas are uh, you can eat them raw, the sugar snap peas, you can eat the pod and you can eat the pea itself. You can take them out the pod and eat the peas um, raw. You can eat them in a salad. Uh, you can cook them down and make a, um, a soup. Uh, everybody, a lot of people like pea soup. Uh, you can saute them. You can mix them with rice. There's many different ways to uh, enjoy your snack peas. So um, that's pretty much it for this installment of our July Spotlight Crop. Again, the August Spotlight Crop is going to be a surprise. I'm just going to bust it out on y'all, and hopefully y'all enjoy it. And again, this is Star Child, Original American Foundation. Y'all be safe, be cool, enjoy. And I'll holler at y'all later. Peace.